Hi everyone, thanks for logging on to MyFoxHurricane.com. Just less than two weeks left in the 2023 hurricane season and we are not quite ready for the curtain call. We still have another tropical system out in the southwestern Caribbean and it is triggering tropical storm watches for Friday through the weekend for parts of the southern Bahamas through Turks and Caicos. That is going to also include eastern Cuba into parts of Haiti and this storm is right now gaining some strength as it kind of picks up some forward momentum off to the north northeast right now only watching it for about a 40% chance of additional development here over the next couple of days but regardless a lot of storminess around this system so as it moves kind of right over parts of Jamaica into the southern islands I will expect quite a bit of rain and the potential for some damaging tropical storm force winds from Friday into Saturday the brunt of that arriving for parts of Jamaica Haiti Cuba later on Friday night and into the overnight and early Early Saturday morning hours. We could be talking rainfall rates 5 to 10 inches with that system, possibly isolated amounts up to about that 16 inch range. So here's a look at where that system is right now. It is being named potential tropical cyclone 22. Right now we only have sustained winds at about 35 miles per hour. Some stronger gusts as it is moving toward the northeast pretty much directly right now at about 15 miles per hour. It was a little bit slower last night, only about eight, nine miles per hour. So it is picking up some speed and and through the weekend, that's when most of the impacts are going to be felt for parts of the Caribbean islands. And we are just a couple of days away from wrapping up this hurricane season. If that system does gain more tropical characteristics, it will take on the name Vince with just two names left on this hurricane season named list.